and welcome to the Divine Rays YouTube channel. I'm Jesslyn Justin and it's such a pleasure to connect with you all once again. I hope and pray that you're all doing well and staying blessed. We all have very good memories of our own mothers. I do have the lovely memories of my mother. Mother is our world. The greatest human love on earth is between a mother and her child. When we are in the company of mother, we forget all that disturbs us. We are comforted and we totally feel secure. It is said that a mother on earth is a unique and another form of God, reflecting on our Blessed Mother Mary. Today, we turn our hearts and minds to a Blessed Mother Mary, a figure of deep devotion and love within the Catholic faith. Dear friends, devotion to Mary is the cornerstone of Catholic spirituality, expressed in a variety of beautiful ways. Among the most beloved Marian devotions are the Rosary, the Novena, the Angelus, and the devotion to the Immaculate Heart. One of the most powerful prayers we can offer to Mary is the Memorare, a heartfelt plea for her intercession. Many of us have experienced Mary's profound presence in our lives as our spiritual mother. Mary is my mother, and she is your mother too. Before Jesus surrendered his life on the cross, he looked down upon Mary and one of his disciples, saying, Woman, behold your son. And to the disciple he said, Behold your mother. John chapter 19, verses 26 to 27. This passage touches me deeply as it reveals Jesus' desire to entrust his mother to all of us. From that moment on, the Blessed Mother became our mother too. The Catholic Church interprets this event as Jesus giving Mary to all believers, inviting us to take her into our spiritual home and our life of faith. Mary's role as our spiritual mother. Because of Jesus, the Blessed Virgin Mary is our mother. She accepted God's invitation to be the mother of the Messiah, nurturing and raising Jesus with unwavering faith alongside Saint Joseph. Mary's role as the mother of Jesus extends to being the mother of the church and of all the faithful. She sets an example of deep faith and trust in God that we are all called to follow. Mary is always there to assist us, eager to see us, love God and follow her son. She helps us in countless ways as she is the mediatrix of all graces, dispensing the graces that God has bestowed upon her for this purpose. No other human being was as close to Jesus as she was and still is. Mary exemplifies how to endure human suffering with grace. She suffered immensely, far more than we can imagine, because the extent of our suffering is connected to the extent of our love. Due to her union with the Holy Spirit, Mary's capacity for love was greater than any other, and so was her suffering. At Calvary, she didn't just suffer the physical pain of the crucifixion. Her immense love for Jesus meant that her suffering was beyond her comprehension. The Church teaches that Mary's suffering was so intense that she nearly died in imitation of her son. This deep connection to Jesus' suffering makes Mary a powerful ally in her times of trial and difficulty. Mary's intercession and guidance We can turn to Mary for prayers, just as we turn to our family and friends. Mary's love for Jesus is boundless, as she desires that everyone knows and loves Him as she does. She comes to our aid as our mother, guiding us towards her son. Remember her words to the service at the wedding feast at Cana? Do whatever he tells you. John chapter 2 verse 5 This is Mary's message to all of us to trust in Jesus and to follow his guidance. Consider the time Mary has appeared on earth, urging us to turn away from sin, to pray the rosary, to pray for sinners and to seek peace. Her message reminds us that Jesus is deeply hurt by the sins of humanity. Yet, out of his love for us and for his mother, he allows Mary to come to us, delivering these urgent messages. As our spiritual mother, Mary is ever ready to help us. She models perfect love and faithfulness to God, interceding for us in prayer and bestowing upon us the graces that God allows her to share. Not only did she instruct the service at Cana to do what he tells you, but she also continually reminds us to heed this advice. Mary knows her son intimately, who he is and what he did for us because she was there by his side. Who better to help us as our spiritual mother? The importance of Marian devotion. Devotion to Mary is an integral part of the Catholic faith. Mary's unique role as the mother of God, her powerful intercession, and her example of unbraving faith makes her an essential figure for Catholics. Through Marian devotions like the Rosary, Novena, the Angelus, and the Immaculate Heart, Catholics can deepen the relationship with Mary and draw closer to God. 
These practices are not just cultural traditions, they are rooted in Catholic theology and spirituality, providing a way to express our love and devotion to Mary. By seeking her intercession, we experience God's love and mercy in a profound way. Let us always strive to honor Mary, following her example of faith and love, as we journey together towards greater holiness and a closer union with our Lord. Mary's presence in our lives. We believe that Mary helps us to follow Jesus, to grow in His likeness, and to bring His transforming grace to the world today. We may sometimes feel Mary's presence through a stronger connection, but even if we don't feel anything, we know by faith that she is always there by our side. We can turn to her at any time for her special help. The Power of the Rosary The Catholic Church advises that every family should embrace the practice of praying the Rosary daily. The Rosary is a great treasure and a powerful tool that we all need to take advantage of. As we recite the Rosary, we meditate on the scriptural passages, asking the Holy Spirit to make us humble and simple and seeking our Blessed Mother's guidance to lead us to the foot of the cross, where we are cleansed by the precious blood of Jesus. May you and your family be abundantly blessed through the intercession of our Blessed Mother Mary. Thank you for watching and learning for your life. Stay connected with us by pressing the bell icon to receive notifications for every new video we upload. And please don't forget to like, subscribe and share your thoughts in the comment section below. See you again in the next video. Thank you and God's blessings.